primal cuts. From the joint to the bone, these are the parts of the animal that harken back to the most original forms of cooking. Hunt it, chop it up, and cook it. You really don't get more primal than a testicle in my mind. I would bring this down and share it with the guys that I'm cooking for, but it's just never going to go far enough. There's inevitably going to be guys that are real jealous that they didn't get a slice, so I'm just going to eat it myself. It's going to be kind of like the cook special. I'm gonna trim him a little bit. He's ready to go. The only way I've ever cooked these from game is in butter. So do like butter balls, butternut. Basically, I'm just like poaching this thing in butter. And a little red hot's good. Then you got like a you know, buck nuts, hot nuts. As soon as it hits that heat, firms right up. It kind of puckers right up. It's almost like what you'd picture happening if he jumped into a cold lake. Me and my buddies used to go over here to this thing called the Testicle Festival in, in Montana. I lived there, and uh, it'd be just that. It'd be like after they'd castrate, you know, for castrate all the steers, or make steers by castrating cattle. In the spring, they'd save those and have that Testicle Festival in the fall. You could tell someone this is a wine time, and you might get away with it till they bit into it. Oh, burst! Just got too built up with pressure. And like any rolls, you wanna let it cool a minute, because if you cut it when it's too hot, you know, the, the juice is run. Strangely, it has a very bacon-like odor. You know, nice texture. The texture a lot like sweet breads, you know? It's almost identical to thymus gland, or mild kidney. Bacon-esque qualities to it, for some reason I'll never understand. It's also not unlike octopus. If you gave someone this, like I don't know how you'd do it though. If you could say it was something that it wasn't, then I don't know what that would be. They would love it until they found out what you're giving them. To think of how many of these things go to waste out in the woods every year is mind-boggling. You guys try one, I mean they're ridiculous.